Welcome to the world of Jeeves, and welcome back for part two of Introduction to Jeeves Universal EOP, ERP, Basic Foundation. In part two, we're going to talk about drill down, online help, built-in collaboration, and logging out. Drill down is accomplished quite easily. For instance, if we're in the order header table and we're in the company ID field and we don't have company and we want to drill down to the customer portion of this, then we simply right click, choose customer table, and then move across. And then you have the drill down. Everywhere that you see the little arrow, on the uh, data box means you can right click and move and drill down and drill down. Let's take a look and see how that works. Okay, here we are at our order table. Here's the company ID. In this case it's 10009. Let's do a right click, go to customers, and as we go to the customer table, so, oh, this customer has a credit limit. It's been exceeded. So there's built-in uh, pop-ups and warnings. This can be either a warning or a block. So if I'm uh, working this particular order and on the phone with the customer, I can say, hey, uh, you have some problems here. And what can we do about it? Anyway, once you get through that, it brings you to the customer table. So here's the uh, data form for filling all the particular information. And that's the drill down. Payment terms. Okay, let's go to payment terms. So we're drilling down. So now we're to the terms and we can take a look. So if there's a change in the terms, so we can do that. We just hit the back arrow to go back to where we started from. And here we are at the menu list. Now we all know there's just an awful lot of information to try to remember when you're using an ERP system. So it's very helpful to have an online help system, which Jeeves does. So in the menu bar, there's a help selection. You click on that. When you click on that, it takes you right over to the help menu. And if you're on a particular field, it'll take you right to that field and it talk to you about uh, all the things you can do with that. All right, let's see how that works. Okay, let's check it out. So let's see, uh, company name. We'll click next to the company name and put a little red check mark. We'll go up to help. We'll go to field. And here's the company ID. It gives us what the table name is. Tells us an alphanumeric designation for the company, gives us some information about it, and tells us where it's used in the table. So you can see it's used in lots of tables. For general content, you can click on the content tab for introduction, basics and advance, for the marketing and sales aspect of it, so you can go through all of this. Search. Uh, if I want to build a macro and do some automatic uh, data manipulation that I do routinely and just only need to change parameters, let's search on a macro. So we can go to the macros table. Here's information about the macro. Here's some tables about it. Talks about the data type, the characters, and everything that you need to know with that. And it tells you the, the main table for this. And if you, as you go through and you look at the uh, particular table, you can see all the different aspects of it. And when you click on the button and it's uh, properly set up, then it will take you right over to the appropriate screen. So that's the help. And when you finish with help, it takes you right back to where uh, you started from. And that works everywhere through the 
whole system. All right, so we've maneuvered our way through the Jeeves screen, and we're filling out the form. Uh, there's some data, some questions that we have, and that's often the case. So when you're doing a traded transaction, you can nearly have all the information, but then you find out at the last minute you need some more information. To do that, Jeeves has made it real easy for you. We've been working in the menu section, but that same section can be converted to notes. You can then convert it to collaborate, which you can then immediately have a chat session with uh, your accounts payable clerk or your salesperson, or if it's a purchasing uh, contact over uh, on the East Coast or West Coast or a different continent, you can do that. Or if you want to go send an email, instead of coming out of this, going into it, going back into email, you can set up email right inside of Jeeves. So menus, notes, collaborate, and email all take place in this section where the menu is now. Let's see how that works. Okay. As you can see, we have a little menu icon here. That's where we are now. If while I was, I got a phone call and um, I got some more information on the Europe, Europe uh, sports and needed to make some information there, uh, say uh, up the order by 1,000 per Mr. Jones. Okay, you can save that. Or you can just leave it there and when use it during your order entry. And when you're finished and you log out, that uh, clears automatically. If you save it, however, it'll be there when you come back. If you want to eliminate that, you can hit clear, then you're ready to go. So that's your notes. That's simple. For the collaborate piece in the user section, so other users that are in, you have that set up. It's like a tree. So you have groups, the sales group and the sales group. You may have Mary, and Jill, and John. In the production group, you have Fred and Sam, and maybe in purchasing, you have Tony. All of those would show up, and if it's green, they're available. If it's red, they're not. You can see the conversation take place here. You can type your messages in. And Jeeves works on Skype. It's built in. So if you have uh, offshore uh, clients or purchasing or customers or whatever, then you can use the Skype uh, feature to contact them directly, and you do that all out of here really really nice feature to have because when you're filling in tables and entering data most of your work is gathering information about that if you want to send an email you can click this icon and it changes it to bring in your email so you can read your emails you can answer emails you can send an email out get a response back so right from this collaborative work center you have your emails you can collaborate with your uh, co-workers and customers and suppliers. You can write notes to yourself and you can always go back to your normal menu. It's really great. It's a very valuable feature that is often forgotten about in ERP systems. But Jeeves has thought of everything. Taking a tour of Jeeves, we've seen the basic foundation that it's built on. You know it's built on SQL as rich client, think client, web access, as uh, file menu formats, which are easy to move around. You have list screens, format screens, embedded menus, embedded uh, forms, the nodes, uh, the collaboration window aspect of that, all the things that make it easy for you to do your business during the day. So now it's time to log out and say goodbye. You uh, log out just like you do with Microsoft. You go to File, go down to Exit, click on Exit. So I want to thank you, and if you want to contact me, uh, please do so. Uh, R. Chamberlain at Jeeves-NA.com is North America, and you can reach me at 562-964-8020.